Royals, what's going on? It's your girl Q the Queen here, back with another video. Now, April is well underway. Well, it's still March, but April is almost here. And uh, we got to get into some of these heaters for April, man. That's what it's all about. So, got one for you. Let's just get straight into it, okay? Here's the box. We got that classic flight font. You know, you know, you know. That jump man, all gold. So looking forward to getting inside of this one. Um, I did see some photos of this one and um, the silhouette. A lot of y'all are fans of this silhouette right here. So let's see if you went to it. Got the paper, kind of clear there with the gold jump man, just like with the box. Let's reveal. Yes, yes. So. What you're seeing is the Air Jordan 4 Vivid Sulfur Women's Exclusive, man. Okay. So I will say, I will say, I will say, <laughs> listen, I was impressed by the pictures, but listen, and this is coming from y'all know me y'all know me i'm not a big jordan here but these are these are fire wait a minute <laughs> wait i wasn't i wasn't expecting this hold up <laughs> hold up hold up now hold up now okay so let me let me collect myself because really I'm, I'm really shocked by these I, i'm really shocked by how i feel so of course i love me a good late 80s early 90s silhouette right um we know there's a few different types of silhouettes that are similar to the air jordan 4. um however on this particular air jordan 4 this colorway hit okay this colorway hit and it's been a lot of women's releases this year so far and uh this <laughs> so far this is the one and i haven't even really got into the shoe i literally just pulled this shoe out and I am impressed by this shoe. Like, this, this, hey, this might be a go. This might be a go. So, uh, what you're seeing here is that Vivid Sulfur colorway on the eyelids. Um, you'll see them on the midsole as well, on the front end of it. Um, you see a little bit of that on the sock liner. You'll see it as well on the Jumpman on the back, which I'm, I'm not mad at the Jumpman on the back on these. Not mad at it at all. Um, it is a white upper, uh, but what the detail that I did not expect, though, was sort of that sail, that sail back heel and midsole toward the back end of the shoe. I was not expecting that, and I think that that is the touch that makes this shoe. Because if it was an all-white midsole to go with that, that Vivid Sulfur sort of uh, yellow there, um, I, I think that it would be a pass for sure. I think it would just be a regular release that doesn't have that, that accent that a classic silhouette like this needs. And that cell touch really does the trick for these. To me. To me. Okay? Um, I also like color blocking on a Jordan 4 when... The upper is pretty much all white and then they hit you with them classic spots where that black is and then that accent color hits them eyelids. So um, they definitely chose the right color blocking for this particular accent color for sure. Vivid Sulfur Jumpman, classic black flight inside of the tongue, black foundation, Vivid Sulfur on the font. And of course, you can see that sock liner as well as the uh, the tongue being all all yellow. We'll just call it yellow for the moment, but it goes with the theme of that vivid sulfur colorway. I will say too, the difference in tone on the eyelid and the sock liner. I'm not I'm not mad at that. There is a clear distinction between this and this. A little bit darker here, which my understanding would be that official color. And then on the sock liner, it's more yellow. Just so we can kind of break down that particular colorway. It's saying white and coconut milk. Um, so it's not even, 
it's honestly not even uh, acknowledging the yellow, goldish, vivid sulfur colorway on the box. Interesting enough though, so the Latin portion says Blanc, Sulfur, Viv, Light de Coco. So it actually acknowledges it on the Latin portion of the colorway font, but not the English version. So interesting. But anyway, you can clearly see that it has that that accent colorway that the actual floor is called. Um, the outsole, it has the combo of the Vivid Sulfur, that sort of cell white that you see. You can see that Vivid Sulfur Jumpman, black pods in between on the foundation there, on the ball of the foot. And so is that Vivid Sulfur foundation, black Jumpman. April 6, 210, like I said, definitely uh this is genuine shock for me okay i did not expect to be as impressed by this colorway as what i am in hand um again don't get me wrong i thought the pictures made them look dope but in hand this thing is not to be played with okay this shoe is fire this shoe is fire not gonna lie not gonna lie okay um for you quality control warriors out there it's not like super tumbled or anything like that but it does have a little bit of butter on it they've been doing very well with the women's releases to me as it relates to the materials um i am happy to be able to just be in the moment you know what i'm saying i'm happy to be alive right now to be able to witness what they're doing for the women these days man so um yeah vivid sulfur air jordan 4 Women's exclusive, baby. April 6th, 210. Let me know in the comment section if y'all thinking about grabbing these joints. Listen, this this is this could be a highlight for April for the Jordan heads out there and even just all of us in general, man. For the casuals, for the sneaker heads, listen, this thing is clean. All right, now I'm gonna get up out of here. Until next time. <laughs> Royalty. <laughs>